You lead a normal life and then something changes. Everything that makes that person a person is stripped away. No one's ever survived dementia. There are no treatments that tackle the disease itself. We need to understand more about the condition. We need to understand how we can treat this disease. We know that research holds the key, and for the research to be able to take place, we need data which doesn't exist. Last year, nearly three million people played Sea Hero Quest, the first mobile game to help scientists fight dementia. We realized we could help scientists get the data they need to further the research by connecting to those already using our technology. As you move around, your position gets relayed back to the scientists and they can see it like a heat map. And that data is used to try and understand on a mass scale how people are navigating around these different mazes. Many of the dementia patients get lost. There's a very important symptom which so far has been really very little investigated. The data from the game creates a global benchmark of spatial navigation in humans. Now Deutsche Telekom are launching the game in virtual reality to take it to the next level. It's the next technological innovation that will not only make the game even more fun, but will help to gather even deeper insights into dementia. Through VR we are able to replicate highly credible lab-based navigation experiments. And the intuitive nature of VR means we can widen the study to a much broader audience. More accurate data, more detailed experiments and more nautical fun. You probably have this mindset, game and technology and kids going to hate it. Once you get the hang of it, it's great. Number two is over there. <laughs> <laughs> ah, nice. By playing this game, they're helping being part of the solution. They're helping us be that little bit nearer to finding those treatments and understanding how we can better diagnose dementia.